so weird. Welcome back to CCNA3. <laughs> okay. That's it. So, we're going to talk about Module 2. Specifically, we're going to talk about router IDs in OSPF. So, in this video, we're going to talk about these router IDs. And that is... Uh... No, I keep doing this. Good morning. It's a beautiful morning. I've got a cup of coffee. My dog, Ellie. She's probably sleeping. So we're going to talk. Must have Welcome to section 2.2 of CCN83. We're going to talk about point-to-point -point OSBF networks. So using the network command, we're going to specify the interfaces that are going to um, is better when you're talking about um, priorities. So we can see here a basic flow chart. Is it explicitly configured? That's number one. If yes, then that's our, our this is wrong. Router ID is explicitly configured. If yes, then use the router ID that's explicitly configured. That, that's wrong. Um, this is embarrassing. Um, welcome back to CCNA3. We're going to talk about Module 2.3, Multi-Access OSPF Networks. So we're going to talk about how OSPF differently treats our multi-cat I didn't sledge, but network, it's, it's the same. These are pretty much synonymous from the per perception of a router. So in some cases, we may want it to be the DR of one network and a druther in another network. Um, just keep that in mind. Um, we want, oh, excuse me, ah, just 